Meet a Trociraptor. A Trociraptor is one of the new dinosaurs in Jurassic World Dominion. And if you haven't heard of it, fear not. Even though it was named in 2004, it's not a dinosaur known much outside of paleontological circles. Well, not until it made its gigantic Hollywood debut. A Trociraptor is a great name. It means savage robber. The bones were found in 1995 in 68 million year old rocks just outside of Drumheller, Alberta, Canada. It's only known from a right maxilla, which is the upper jaw, a pair of premaxillae, which are the bones that comprise the snout, and the dentaries, which are the lower jaw. It lived at the same time as Bambi Raptor, Sauronothelestes, two other dinosaurs you may not have heard of, as well as Velociraptor, which was hanging out in Mongolia. However, a Trociraptor is definitely a different kind of dromaeosaurid, aka raptor, because its skull is short front to back and deep. And also, all of the teeth, they, they point throatward, and they are all the same size. The majority of the raptors out there seem to have dentition that varies in size. The teeth are not what we call isodont across the board. Based on the skull, we're presuming that the animal was around six feet long from the nose to the tail, and after a big meal, it probably hit 30 pounds. Think of a big turkey, but with claws and teeth to really tear something up. We're showing the Atrociraptor here with feathers as using something called phylogenetic bracketing. We believe that the Atrociraptor was feathered because it's a dromaeosaurid and we know that its close cousins Velociraptor and Dakotoraptor had feathers at least on its arms thanks to quill knobs on the ulnae. However, there's no guarantee it was feathered and it appears that Jurassic World Dominion may very well choose to have a Trociraptor be like the old classic raptors where it's scaled throughout. I dream someday of someone finding an actual feathered uh, dromaeosaurid, but feathers don't preserve well and in the environments we find them in Western North America at least, we certainly haven't found any feathered indications yet. I hope you've enjoyed this tour of a Trociraptor and look forward to more videos from Fossil Crates. You can find a number of the items in this presentation at fossilcrates.com for sale. We offer museum quality casts for all of your awesome fossil cast needs. Thank you kindly. Adios.